Alright guys, so, just wanted to let you know that I leave in the community tab of my channel all these videos and uh, links to the news and stuff that's happening now. I just recently shared uh, a video where a group of people who are Christian and they have dreams and visions and they have a connection where they share the news that they see and the headlines. And God talks to them and points them to things so they are warned before all these things happen. They keep warning of Russia and China possibly attacking soon. They're sending submarines our way to Cuba. Um, there's in the in the video, if you look at the video, um the person's uh talking about uh navy ships that Russia has, and all these, the, the B-2 uh, wing, um, you know, airships. Chris Estep had dreams about B-2 bombers. Um, th these, uh, ladies are having, uh, dreams about Navy ships and t calling them sharks, and that these Navy ships are going to be possibly affecting the coastline and hurting people, um, and possible future invasion, I keep talking, me personally, I keep talking about how I keep seeing people's dreams in the comment section where they talk about bombs coming from Canada, bombs coming from the south, uh, an EMP possible, a possible tsunami, a uh, possible earthquake in California. All these things I keep warning about and sharing, letting you know that God is basically pointing to everything that Russia and China are not playing. They, uh, I just recently saw an article where uh, Xi Jinping uh, said that the United States is the major threat and that it's uh, the, the major threat in the world and that it's not bringing peace to other countries. So, the United States is a major threat. So, Russia and China are going to possibly take out the United States, is what I'm saying. From all, what from the article that I'm seeing, from everything uh, in people's dreams that is happening. So, please be aware that the possibility of Russia and China invading are very great. People are having dreams. Uh, this one lady had dreams that planes were dropping parachutes with boxes. And these boxes inside had grenades. They were basically bomb and parachutes being dropped. And this person had to get in a truck and uh, try to escape the best they could with their family. Because the parachutes with the bombs were coming down. So these are just dreams. Uh, an example of dreams of people experiencing all this stuff. Another person had dreams where... Um, they were at work, and they noticed that they were working at a drive through and they noticed that Chinese soldiers had come up, and they had to close the, the window and close everything down because the Chinese soldiers were coming. And the Chinese soldiers had an advanced technology laser weapon where they could just g cut over glass and over the door and just open the door um, and uh, just open and go in. So, pretty much, the, the Chinese and Russians are coming, is basically what I'm saying. And it's not a warning to have fear, because we have Jesus Christ, and Jesus Christ saves us. And we have to have uh, d discernment, share the news that uh, a lot of stuff is happening. Uh, all these Russian and Chinese threats that people just ignore. People just go to a party, or they... They just, eh, it's, it's nothing, it's not important. And they just shoulder shrug it. Pay attention. All this stuff is happening for a reason. It is judgment from God. God is serious, and he wants everybody to repent and return to him and stay with Jesus and God in heaven when he, when he rescues us in the rapture. Because the people that are going to be left behind are going to have to face seven years of really bad stuff. And all these people, the military soldiers that are going to be left behind, are not going to be good. 
they're going to have to face all of this and persecution and all this stuff that's going to be coming. Alright, so my video is getting a little bit long, five or uh, so minutes long. Uh, on the phone is a lot of data, so I'm just going to stop now. But check out the community tab and please pray for discernment. Ask God to guide you, to show you the things you need to see so you can be aware and uh, accept Jesus Christ as Savior because we need it. Alright, see you guys next time. God bless.